Hello and welcome back. In this short lecture, we will be working with PowerShell server management features or the Windows features uh, in other way. Like uh, most of the times, either Windows admins will be working with the server manager for installing some kind of features. So why can't we automate that uh, feature sets like instead of adding roles directly from here in this situation, uh, let me show you here, let it load the specific one here. You can check out here the services are uh, currently this specific machine does not have the features of web server has not installed so what i can do is i can uh, get it this web server installed with a powershell to do that what i can do is i can simply open a powershell so in my case i'm opening powershell isc and from here uh, there is a commandlet which can be used for uh, windows features like when i type this i'm getting as a windows features just hit enter uh, that would actually uh, gives me the command complete to be you know fulfilled so i can uh, get i'm getting the windows features currently whatever it got installed so i'm just running only the selected command lead. so in this case it's actually showing everything so i don't want this kind of you know, output maybe i can filter further level uh, with uh, anything which is a name uh, like a web hyphen server and now i should be able to just get that specific value uh, so here you can see here uh, it's just coming as a web server uh, which is i guess uh, there's no tick mark if you can you know look at here some of them has been already ticked up that means uh, the x indicates here as that specific feature uh, set has been installed on those machines so in this case uh, on this specific machine uh, the web services has not installed so our next task would be to automatically uh, we wanted to install the specific service so what I'm gonna do is let me first comment this uh, by pressing shift 3 which is a, a hash uh, so it got you know commented so this code doesn't execute if you try to execute also nothing will come up because it is in a commented state now now we can start uh, using another command uh, install hyphen windows feature to install that specific service uh, that's a web uh, specific service if you can look at here so it's getting actually instantly installing uh, now what i can do is either i can you know uh, uh, give here as uh, a filter one more filter to just to you know get installed with the filter uh, install windows feature also i can give here or uh, directly i can uh, say that hey you can you know go ahead and install web server so either way it's going to work either this command or this command should uh, work so it's actually getting installed post to that i can rerun this specific command to um, call whether this specific services or specific role has installed or not now the specific service has been already installed if we can see as the success successfully installed as true now let's get the service back uh, like uh, this is selection of this specific script now I should be able to get the specific service as X box earlier if you can you know uh, locate it was not the X now uh, we have this specific service got installed now it looks good let's also explore how this uh, the specific install hyphen feature can be explained here so uh, what i can do is i can either uh, go back here to view here install feature and show details if i go back here let me zoom it maybe it would be good for you if i can zoom in a zoom window i can fill these values as uh, like the this this is the role of the specific service for example uh, if this is a web service uh, we wanted to check it so i'm just ha checking for the web service and on a remote computer so the computer name is uh, I wanted to execute on INH what if it this is 01 and what would happen I just wanted to know what if we did even explain the, uh, this what if how to use in the previous lectures uh, so what if is basically tells you know what's gonna happen if I execute this command so this will give you a kind of a confirmation uh, whether this kind of a command is going to work or not or any kind of a change going to happen or not so in this case when i say run uh, it's going to actually make me a complete uh, command let me scroll uh, to the right side here and uh, it has built this feature and it has even uh, saying that hey this has been already there so no changes are uh, needed for this specific service 